This smells It gnarly. smells like a... I'm gonna be... Well, we should probably... I don't know. Judge... We'll see what's gonna happen. <laughs> this has been f extremely freshly door dashed directly to us. Yep. It's These been are in this building 45 seconds. Cheetos... Boneless wings from Applebee's. I have Little absolutely no Applebee's. idea what to expect. That actually looks okay. That's not what I expected because I thought I thought these were this. Wait, we have two different ones. We have two. So it's, okay, we have we have boneless, just straight up. This smells. It gnarly. smells like a flaming hot Cheeto. It smells gnarly. <laughs> this room just immediately smelled. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't know if this is a good thing or a bad thing. Okay, we have boneless, just regular straight up the ch like Cheetos. Cheetos. Cheetos, okay. and then we have the flaming hot Cheetos. Okay. okay. So and the room smells like a flaming hot. Uh, are you a fan of, of Applebee's? No, I am not a fan <laughs> no. of Applebee's. Okay, we're gonna start with the Cheeto ones as a control, and then we're gonna move on to the flaming hot ones. <laughs> we're gonna see. I'm actually I'm actually a fan of flaming hot Cheetos. I love flaming hot Cheetos. I'm. I'm I good. love flaming hot. I'm good with it, but I just don't know how well it's going to translate here. Okay, I brought up uh, Applebee's website, so they're saying, okay, a mischievous twist on the traditional wing sauce with the original Cheetos flavor you know and love, tossed in sauce and then coated in crunchy, crunchy, crunchy original. What sauce? That's I don't know what that means. Oh, no. Okay, look, they look good. It doesn't look. It, it looks hilariously vibrant. Okay, like, like that's, novelty, bright. I'm just if they're crunchy, if there's a crunch to, on the outside of this, I'm gonna say that this is somewhat of a success. It bef at least that. But it's been like, clearly, if we would have got this in a restaurant, it'd be better. But it's sat there. And we can't film there. It kind of sat there and steamed itself inside the bag a little bit. So they also they look like fried blue, uh, like bluegill. Blue it looks like fried fish. Bluegill. Very specific there. It John. does. I mean, we ate that a lot as a kid, so that's what it looks like. Um, it feels crunchy. I'm not gonna lie. It does. It feels it feels hard, like a nugget, like a hard rock. It smells like Cheetos. It genuinely smells like Cheetos. It kind of does smell like a Cheeto. I'm gonna say I'm kind of impressed at the moment. Let's if we it. like this, I'm gonna be very upset. I'm gonna be real mad if I like, <laughs> like <laughs> Alright, cheers, man. Holy crap. It really tastes like a Cheeto. It's got a crunch, but it just tastes like a. It doesn't taste like anything. Like a mild wing. It doesn't. I'm not getting Cheeto flavor though. Mm -mm. It's got a little crunch to it. It's extraordinarily breaded. Um, like the thickness of the breading is like half of the substance of that one that I'm eating. It's like a chicken nugget. And I mean, they're not bad. It's, not it's better than what I expected. I'm gonna get. All right, I need to eat one more. It doesn't look terrible on the inside. Look at that. No. Look at that. All white meat. I don't hate them. It's not. It's not the worst thing I've ever had. No. It's not the best thing I've ever had in no. my life. Doesn't taste like a Cheeto though. It doesn't taste anything like a Cheeto. It, it, it's a weird chicken nugget. You know, like it's got a little bit of a crunch to it. It's fine. These look worse. I'm not gonna lie. Because you're getting to see like the actual nugget more. Yeah. On this, like you can clearly tell that like they have their nuggets, I believe, and then. The coating is actually applied secondary, so I'll give that like a bonus to Applebee's. I feel like, but I don't know how to feel about this. They are the most massive sized boneless wings I've ever it's, seen. Yeah, they're monsters. They're huge. <sighs> okay, I feel like this is the most coated one I can see. So something that gives like the flaming hot spice. Okay, hold on. Description. Turn up the heat with Cheetos right. flaming hot flavor. Uh, it hits the spot, tossed in sauce, and coated in crunchy che Cheetos flavored hot crumbles. Uh, Service seller in house made ranch or blue cheese. I did not get those because I'm not a monster. Um, so the flaming hot has like this like citric acid like sourness note to them that I actually really like. And I'm I, there. There needs to be like some sort of like lime or lemon or some sort of citrus happening to kind of replace that. I don't know. Let's just see what happens. Cheers. It's kind of there. Kind of there. It's got the tang. It doesn't taste like flaming hot in any way, shape, or form. But that tang I'm talking about is kind of there. It is. It is a little. It doesn't taste like a flaming hot Cheeto, at all. But it's. It does what it's supposed to do. Okay. Um, my nose is running now. My nose is really running because it's 30 degrees in this it building. It is so cold <laughs> in this building. Um, okay. Um, could there be, in my opinion, could there be better 
flaming hot boneless wings. Absolutely, one hundred thousand percent. They're probably out there somewhere too. Could there be worse? Absolutely, one hundred thousand percent. They're probably out there somewhere. I know. If they would have made this like a like a wet sauce and then put the fla the flaming hot Cheetos on top of it and maintain that crunch with like a sauce, to, like double down on the flavor. Mm -hmm. Like this could be really great. Um, in its form right now, would you order these again? If I had to go to Applebee's, probably. I don't think I'd ever order these again. I mean, I don't like Applebee's. I don't think they have anything very good on the menu. I agree. But I think this is, if you have to go there, this isn't bad. I probably would get the would get the other ones though. You think you think these are better? Yeah. I mean, for what you're getting. I'm trying to isolate some of this like crunchiness. It doesn't taste like cheese. No. I'm not really sure what I'm tasting. It's like yellow breadcrumbs. They they don't land with their intentions, but they're not bad. I, I agree with you. Um, clearly a monstrous novelty product. Like the novelty factor is is huge here. And I think they're gonna sell a lot of these just by I do too. just by like the sheer the name. The name, the look of it. Like how insane is that look? If you can use the Cheeto name, you you've done something. Like it looks it looks so insane. And so crazy yeah. looking. And like, I mean, Flaming Hot Cheetos actually have a little bit of kick to them. Mm -hmm. I'm mean, I'm literally sitting out of one. I'm not. I like. I, I and that's and you're, that's you're, just to give it a. You're you're reminding me that I had to get a heat scale on it. Like, like exactly. There's I could go less happening. than a one. Yeah. Um, but okay. I mean, for uh, the one of the biggest sit down chain restaurants in the country, which I'm not a fan of chain restaurants, obviously, like. I think a homegrown place could do much better and dress the wing and then shake it in crunched up hot, flaming hots, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. They could do it much better. I will always support like a any food establishment trying to bring spicy food into the limelight because all it's going to do is turn on more people to spicy food. Mm -hmm. So that, I'm going to say, is a win. That being said, these could have been done much better. They could have done been done much worse. They we probably they break it completely even on my scale. We probably know people that could do this better. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, there's this. So in the description below, be a link to Applebee's. So you can check them out if you want to <laughs> check them out. <laughs> also to Justin, I yelled at you guys last time about this, and people actually really thought that was funny. They and dude, and they're full of crap when they say it's caramel. It is caramel. You guys are all insane. You're wrong. Everyone's wrong. I hope you enjoyed. See you guys. I did night. get drugged for seeing saying pecan though. Yes, you did. I got drugged, so <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos uh, from now on. I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going <laughs> to. Oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.